Hello everybody, welcome back to Foul Ball Breaks. Today we are opening up some 2020 Tops Allen and Ginter. Uh, so for those of you who have opened Allen and Ginter or seen videos before, you know this gets a little funky. Um, because of that, we're not going to do a top five. Why well, normally put some over there? We will do a trivia question I'll put right there at the bottom. ba -doo. Trivia question is, before DJ LeMayhew and Luke Voigt, who were the last two teammates to claim the home run crown and batting title in the same year? So think about that as we're going through these. Um, look for autograph and relic cards. We have seven packs plus one extra pack, six cards per pack. Okay, so like I said, it gets a, it gets a, a little funky here. Um, it's, it's, we'll still get the same... I mean, if you want to think of a top five, we'll still get the same top five as we normally get for 2020 products. Robert, Lewis, Alvarez, Lux, Boba Shet. Um, But this gets weird because, like, every pack has, like, a farm card where you get, um, like, a pig or you get a dog or a tractor or a bale of hay. There's non-baseball cards, like Jared Carabas is in this from Barstool. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, Johnny Bananas is in this. And you can get relics from, like, Johnny Bananas and autographs and stuff. So, those were, I mean, relics and autographs are always going to be in, in the top. But, yeah, these get a little weird. There's a lot of non-baseball cards. But we're just looking for rookie cards. Right there on the back, we see a nice Nico Horner. That's a great start. Jeff McNeil. Um... We have Lorenzo Kane snuck into the playoffs. Dennis Eckersley. We have Carlton Fisk. We have a pink opal. This is what I'm talking about. Look at that. Sweet card. Nice. Digging deep. Let's see what's on the back. Opal's color. I'm not, I'm not going to read that. You, you can pause it and uh, look at it. But the pink opal card is in there. But we get a uh, Nico Horner rookie card. So that's going in, in the maybe pile. And our Cubs pile. So if you're new to Fall Ball Breaks, thank you very much. Hit the subscribe button, like, comment, shoot me an email. Uh, what we do is we like to um, put aside uh, at least four cards, and then we, the maybe pile can grow as large as possible, and we'll make a Mount Rushmore of the cards that we, that we got on the video. Um, Miguel Sano, Mike Trout, and then a rule of thumb, Mike Trout will always go in the maybe pile. Ozzy Albies, um, where monsters live under the stairs. It's a mini card. If you think that's weird, uh, we have a corn stalks card. Yep, cool, sick. Brendan McKay rookie card. That's also a nice one. He's a two-way player. Rays are the best team in baseball. Pretty electric stuff. So, guys, two packs in. We're already three cards in the maybe pile. So I'm feeling pretty good. Here is Teft. Who is Teft, you may ask? He's Steven Teft, owner of 12 tattoos and body piercing in Gordon, Connecticut. He's been playing his trade 20 years. He's uh, tried out for Ink Master. He won the title season two. So he's the Ink Master season two champion. Nice. Mike Schmidt, Alan Trammell. Um... Portuguese Man of War, Behemoths of Beneath, mini card. Nito Mosquito. Joe Torre, uh, which ironically feels thick. And Abraham Toro. Rookie cards will always go in the maybe pile. I'm going to separate it a little bit because I don't think we're going to use it. But I'm feeling pretty good. Um, so, yeah, so so far, if you haven't seen this open, what do you guys think? It's, it's definitely different. The card stock is really nice. It's 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 one of the more thicker card stocks. Here's uh, Rob Freeman. Um, he's, yep, that's him. That's big old Rob. That's Pitching Ninja. So in case anyone's wondering what he, Pitching Ninja looks like, there he is. He has his own card. DJ, DJ LeMayhew, part of our trivia question, won the batting title. Aaron Judge. We have a mini Lorenzo Kane. Long Ball Lore of Hideki Matsu, which is actually a pretty cool looking card if you want to see the back of it. A lot of words there. Uh, and Brian Reynolds. Um, four packs left. Technically, I already have enough for 
or Mount Rushmore, but I don't want to see Abraham Toro make the Mount Rushmore. I wouldn't mind seeing a little more firepower like uh, Julian Edwards, who is in Bird Box. That's what this guy is known for. He's the kid in Bird Box. Good job, Julian. You made it, man. Kerry Wood, that's actually a pretty cool card. That's yeah, going up in the Cubs file. Tony Dunst is a poker player. Sick. Um, Kyle Farmer, a debut to remember. And Victor Robles card. Uh, so yeah, so Alan and Ginter is not really one of my favorites. Even the high value ones aren't even that valuable. Uh, but it's still the same price as a regular old blaster box here. I see some color up here, so that's either going to be a blue bordered card or it's going to be a tower. So... Trevor Bauer, I'm probably going to win the NL Cy Young. Nick Ahmed, Larry Doby, George Brett, and it is the Lakita La Center. Guess what, folks? That's another cut. We are on to another cut. Uh, got the new phone update for iPhone, um, and it's all, everything's all over the place, all right? Um, so, didn't have enough memory, deleted some stuff. We're good. La Lakata Center, very good. Eric Hosmer, um, there we go. So, two packs left. A little light on the maybe pile compared to what we started off with, but we have two fun rookies. We have Abraham Toro, who's not a fun rookie, and we have Mike Trout, who I will always put on the Mount Rushmore. Is that Luis Arias? Luis Arias. Tommy Edmond. We have Doc Gooden. We have a mini of Christian Yelich. We have Lapis digging deep. And we have Hunjin Ryu. Hunjin Ryu. Folks, we're, we're on to our last pack. Before DJ LeMayhew and Luke Voigt just did it, who were the last two teammates to claim the home run crown and the batting title in the same season? Jake, if you're watching this, you should be able to guess... What pair of 1959 teammates got this? One of them is your guy. Jose Alfaro, Willie McCovey, Don Mattingly. We have a mini of Miguel Tejada. We have a horse. That's a horse. And we have Danny Vogelbach. Folks, kind of a dumper to finish off there. If I'm going to be honest, don't want Abraham Toro in there, but we'll always take the rookies. Um, Nico Horner, Mike Trout, Brendan McKay, and Abraham Toro. Uh, so to finish off, uh, we've got the trivia question before DJ LeMayhew and Luke Voigt. Who were the last two teammates to claim the home run crown and the batting title? The answer is 1959's teammates Hank Aaron, batted 355, and Jake's boy Eddie Matthews, 46 home runs. Thank you for watching, folks. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button. Tell everyone you know that owns a computer to watch this. Um, Nico Horner, Mike Trout, Brandon McKay, Abraham Toro, Alan Aginter. <laughs> Stinks. I'm glad you watched it. Thank you.